my name is Kim Kirshen and I am the director of Walker 505 and founder. Um, we see students from Bernalillo County, throughout Bernalillo County, from kindergarten through 12th grade that are in need of clothing to go to school. So any school, whether it's APS, charter, private, public, any school can refer their students to us. And that's how the kids get to us, as a, a counselor, um, a, a nurse, a teacher, a principal, anybody from the school can refer a student to us that's in need of clothing so that they can go to school, feel comfortable, and feel confident. That's what we're trying to build is some confidence. Um, we have teachers tell us time and time again, I don't know who that kid is you sent back to me. They're a different kid, they're a different student. And if you think about it, we're all that way. If we have a new outfit on, if it fits well, if it's not tight because we've gained 10 pounds, um, those types of things, we feel better about ourselves. We hold our head higher. You know, we're just better. Um, and that's our goal with these kids, is that they go back to school and they feel good about themselves. Um, and they can raise their hand and answer a question and not worry about somebody looking at them because their clothes are too small or have holes in them. Two of the biggest things that we always need are socks and underwear. We just do it of all sizes. Again, I, I you know, talked about the range of sizes that we have to keep. Um, so, you know, uh, even if you, you know, buy underwear and you try one pair on and it's like, ooh, these are not what I thought, give us the rest of that pack. We'll take, we'll take them. Same with socks. Um, the other thing that we are always in need of is jeans. Um, because we use a tremendous amount of jeans because that's typically what the kids get are three pairs of jeans and then shirts to go with it, girls or boys. And again, I think adults need to remember that we take adult sizes. I think they forget that, uh, you know, we see all the way through high school. And I will tell you, there are lots of high schoolers that are way bigger than some of the adults that, that I know. So we need every size of jean from four or five, because some of our kinders are really little, all the way up. And we go through those really like water because every kid gets those. So those are some of the big things. The other thing, that um, just to mention is that we never purchase, but we always need our bras. We do not purchase those because they're outrageously expensive, unfortunately. Uh, our funding doesn't allow that, but we'd love for people to donate them. Again, if it's that bra that you tried on and you went, oh, this is not, you know, you've just worn a couple times, we can accept those. We have uh, a good portion of our kids that are actually homeless. Um, kiddos and so we put together little survival kits of the travel size soaps shampoos cream rinses those types of things because that's something they can keep in their backpack and wash up at school or you know a little more discreetly um, and the kids love those those are just a prize to them you would be amazed um, how many kids are like oh I have my own shampoo or I have shampoo the other is toothbrushes and toothpaste um, we've had a number of kids say I don't have to use my finger anymore I don't have to use my brother's toothbrush. Um, and that, you know, that was a real eye-opener for us of, wow, we need to make sure we have these things in stock. So uh, a grant from Albuquerque Involved would be huge to us for several different reasons. One, um, we would love to add that third time for kids, or at least for certain kids that we know are, um, have larger needs than others, at least. Um, but the other thing is, is we want to continue to be able to give that five pairs of socks and underwear. And the first thing that goes when our money goes is we start to give less socks and less underwear. And we hate to have to do that. That is just something that we'd rather not do. So the grant would certainly serve both of those purposes in keeping us um, being able to give five pairs of socks and underwear a week's worth to a kid, school week's worth to a kiddo, um, and uh, possibly, at the very least, being able to see some of the needier kids that third time during the year. So that would be our, our goal for that, that grant.